Hello college students! Today's episode of College Advice is going to be a lightning round of sorts in which I'm just gonna go through a couple of old questions that you guys left on other videos and I'm gonna answer them quickly with sass. Mm. How do you deal with being attracted to or having a crush on a professor? Well, let me tell you, I am not a stranger to this problem. I pretty much have a crush on anyone who stands in front of me and teaches me something. It's a curse. My advice is to remind yourself why you're there and remind yourself why they are there. Also, if they have like a wife or a pregnant wife or children or a husband or whatever, maybe remind yourself of that. Write little notes on your notebook, like pregnant wife, pregnant wife, pregnant wife, pregnant wife. Do not date anyone who is currently your teacher. What do you do about sickness in college? having to miss class, etc. Good question. This is one really good reason why you should talk to other people in your class. Just exchange email addresses or phone numbers with someone in case you need to ask what reading you missed or if they took attendance that day or whatever. If you're actually sick and you're not just playing it, email your professor before you miss the class, not during or after. And especially if you have like an essay due or a homework assignment that could be scanned in, send that along with your email because it really shows that you're actually sick, not lying about anything. And then if you ever do want to lie, you have a good track record. Sometimes I am highly unmotivated to study and do homework despite the fact that I have a ton. I made a couple videos in this series before about like getting motivated or forcing yourself to work when you're tired, so there's a lot more advice in those videos, but for now what I can say is just schedule your time really tightly so you don't have the option to slack off. If you have a meeting for a club you have to be at at 8 o'clock, you can't wait to start your paper at 7.30. Cablamo says, how to get through school if it's absolutely miserable, like ways to make it better. I've also done some videos on this topic before, one of them being in September when I talked about like mental health and things, but uh, to reiterate, if you're having the problem that you're just completely miserable, try seeing a school counselor or going to the school psychological services. Your school will probably have people in place to help in this kind of situation because it is not rare at all. There's probably someone who can show you what kind of group to join or what kind of activity to start or even and give you resources to look at transferring to other schools. Macaramadebla says that I peel bananas like a freak. Okay, where the sequinzy number in the back of my closet. Do you mean this one? Because I have a lot. Yay! So hopefully you heard something in this video that will give you some kind of confidence boost or some kind of advice that you were looking for. If you have questions or topic suggestions for future videos, leave them below. If you have advice for other college students or people who are college students now when you aren't anymore or yet, leave them below as well. See you Monday!